Guys, they said Toby could not hold her tears on hearing that Oni bought a beach house stroke resort in Queen Naomi's name in Lakey. And she, he did not only buy this beach house. Information have it that uh, Kabiesi and Queen Naomi spent two nights right there in the beach, in the beach house, you know. To cool off, to enjoy themselves, to sort out things, you know, to strengthen their love life. Because a lot of people said they need to do that. They need to do that. Before now, it has just been going to church, going to program. If there's an event, that is when you see them staying in the palace. But these two, they are still young. Eh? They need that love entanglement and all of that. They said the reason why... Uh, our Olori TikTok could not hold her tears such that they say she breaks down big time was the fact that when uh, she was still dating Kabiesi, according to the information, you know, uh, there was a time they said she was telling Kabiesi how important it is for him to, you know, own a beach house there in Lekki so that when they finally got married, yeah, anytime they want to go and they have good time, they can go there and spend their time together to avoid any form of destruction and all of that. That was what they said uh, Oluru TikTok suggested to KBSC then, you know, when it was just sweet and rosy for them. <laughs> when you are enjoying another man's, another woman's husband, you think it's going to last forever. <laughs> So at that time, they said she suggested that to, for, uh, to KBSC, and KBSC uh, accepted the idea, saying that uh, he would think about it. You know, that was then. Now, a lot have changed. A lot of things have changed, you know, ranging from uh, the issue of uh, children and no children, DNA and no DNA, returning back and not returning back, and all of that. So they said when uh, Auntie uh, Olori TikTok hears that KBC bought that uh, beach and did not buy it in her name or in the name of her own children, that it was in Queen Naomi's name. They say she was devastated, that that was her idea. How could KBC do this to her? That that is unfair. They say she was crying big time. And information have it that she couldn't even bear it such that they say she decided to go to that uh, please, <laughs> she decided to go and create scene because that is one thing they know how to do best. But the question is, how did she know? They said information have been flying on social media. You know that these people, I believe that they are paying the the guards very well to be giving them this information, and that is why Kabi huh, should be very careful with the guards and security and uh, even his driver as a matter of fact all those staff walking around him he should be very careful with them because most of this information uh, i believe they are it is through them that the oloris are getting the information about kbc and queen naomi but it is what it is whether they get the information or not it does not change anything they say kbc and queen naomi they are cooling off right there they are enjoying themselves. They are having good time. And I said that uh, very soon, uh, Tade Nikawa will have a sibling. Yes, so Tade Nikawa will have a sibling. Even though there is other good news that uh, Dr. Lizzie is expecting. So right now, it is going to be double, double from the two lovely wife of Kabiesi. Because to me, the only two wife that I recognize happens to be this uh, Dr. Lizzie and Queen Naomi. Mm -hmm. Every other Olori in a counterfeit. <laughs> I beg, oh, I beg. Now, here I hear. Oh. Don't forget that these are all alleged information. Okay, before we proceed, yeah, welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you are yet to subscribe. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much. I really appreciate your support for me. My God will bless you. Always remember that these are all rumored information. They are not for stand information. I wasn't there. I hear, I hear. And when I hear, I come and share with you. 
but I will always uh, tell you that they are not for standing formation, okay? So I believe KBC is wise. He knows what he is doing. Most of this investment, he is doing it in Tadenikawo's name and in Quinami's name for future reference because he knows that if these women, uh, if anything happens today, <laughs> they go drag everything go to go to, and uh, if cares is not taken, uh, Tadenikawo might not be able to, you know, get anything from him. So that is why he have decided to be taking care of things right now that he is still young vibrant strong and okay so i believe that uh uh, uh, uh knows what is the reason is because even when this uh, anti igbi suggested uh an oil well for him they said that we are uh, going for that processing the oil well thing with anti igbi but all of a sudden that one they said it was a uh, uh, lady it was lady that uh, told KBC that look oh, you see this lady she's not to be trusted of course she's not to be trusted because she have betrayed uh uh lady so lady will advise kbc not to trust her because one day one day she will strike and right now with the information we are hearing she is striking every now and then but god of penomi and, and the prince and the union of ife is bigger than her and her jazz and everything that was why they said kbc abandoned the papers of the uh, uh, that oil you were that he was processing with Antigbi and started a fresh one or uh, with the help of a uh, lighter bad moose who is also into oil and oil and gas and uh, dr elizabeth jack rich kbc's daughter and um, her husband <laughs> these are the two people that later helped kbc to acquire that oil you were and he did not do it again in his name. They said it was in Tade Nikawo's name. Mm -hmm. At least that one is secured for Tade without stress. So almost all their ideas, like this one is crying that this beach resort, beach resort is her idea. So always, almost all their ideas, KBC is converting it to Naomi's uh, gain. So they are in that marriage to help Naomi grow. And that is what they are doing. So that is why they say when she heard about it, she was crying. She cried so badly that I said, hey, yeah, hey, yeah, if it is too much for you, I beg, go back to your ex-husband. Let Kwenomi go back to her own husband and enjoy her marriage. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Tell me what you think about it on the comment section. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye for now. Love you guys.